Hi, my name is Jack Codgins. Welcome back to my channel. We're doing a quick update on the new firmware released by DJI for the Inspire 1. And I do believe this might also um, be for the Phantom 3s. So you need to re remember to um, read the release notes that comes with the updates. You must apply the firmware to the Phantom or the Inspire first because it's got a new um, update that did, uh, sorts the encryption out that way way the Phantom or the Inspire talks to the controller, it's a new encryption bit across that. So you don't do it the right way around, it causes lots of problems, which has been causing problems now on social media. Some people have done it and they can't now talk to their um, Phantom or the Inspire. So make sure you install the firmware first for the Phantom or the Inspire and then do the RC update afterwards. So do it that way around. So if you read the release notes, it tells you you have to do this one this way around otherwise cause lots of problems and i do believe uh, it's it's causing problems where the inspire landing links don't come down or they don't retract up or something to do with that effect if you do it before do it the wrong way around um so just be warned so if you are having those sort of same difficulties and you've um let, comment below let me know but the ones you haven't updated yet beware and make sure you do it the right right way around which is inspire then your controller and then you'll be good to go i did mine this morning and i did it, did it the correct way around and it's fine all works perfect so make sure it's the right way around to get it there so this is me with a quick update so see you soon and i've got some more videos coming out this week so stay tuned and if you're not a subscriber hit that subscribe button now hit the like button and any questions you've got on this update comment below and i'll try and do my best to help you out so see you later bye say bye noah bye <laughs>